$120? Come on, I have heard it all. Who is paying this? What's up you guys, I'm Kristen Cavallari and today I'm playing Expensive Taste Test with Cosmo. Sometimes I think that price matters because I do think sometimes you do get what you pay for. I'm kind of a bougie bitch to be honest, so I feel like I'm gonna nail these expensive ones. These feel cheap as <laughs> Wow. There is no weight to this at all, which takes your cost down. I mean, this is like paper thin. To me, that screams cheap. This is heavier and it's smaller, which is interesting. They both look kind of cheap to be honest, but I'm gonna go with this one being the more expensive solely based on the weight of the earring. Oh, thank God. <laughs> I'm like, shit, that would not be a good look. $8.99, probably cost them 69 cents to make. <laughs> Those ones are $325. What? Oh my God. They're 300 and what? This stone looks like something you'd get at Claire's. I'm sorry. You guys are getting ripped off. <laughs> oh, you guys are giving me two shots of tequila? God, can I have a chaser? I mean. Well, this is nice, balance, you know? All right. Oh my God. Whoa, the difference in smell is wild. This one makes me want to throw up and this one I'm like, it's not so bad. It tastes, actually, that's not true. It smells like rubbing alcohol. Ugh. Oh. I couldn't even taste it. Okay, this one. <laughs> that's also how I take shots, by the way. This one doesn't taste like anything. So I'm gonna say this one is more expensive because it actually smells and tastes like tequila, where this one, I think this is nail polish remover. This one is more expensive. Cha-ching! My first episode filming The Hills, Heidi and Spencer showed up with a bottle of tequila and shit just went downhill. And that's when I was yelling. You guys came at me like oh, f***ing well, piranha. I just Listen, can't. You that's tequila's fault. That was not me. <laughs> that was all tequila. All right, here we have candles. The smell smells very fake in this one to me. This one is a very light smell. Maybe it's more of a oil or something. I like a light scent when it comes to candles. Nothing too overpowering. I also know, because we have candles at Uncommon James, that this votive is probably very expensive, where this one is probably pretty cheap. I think this one's more expensive. I really hope I'm right on this, because otherwise I'm gonna sound like a dipshit. <laughs> Thank God! <laughs> I know my candles, baby. This is a nice, stretchy material. I feel like I might know this brand, but it's just a good tank top. I would wear this, absolutely. This is a great a great staple just to have in your closet. In fact, tank tops like this, I like having in every single color. This one is a bit more elevated, if you will, with some lace, which I feel like is you guys trying to throw me off. So even though this one has more detail, which it's probably more expensive to manufacture. I'm still gonna go with this one being more expensive. Let's see. Yay. This is $23. Would you spend 23 bucks on that? I wouldn't buy this, period. <laughs> I mean, this just isn't my style. I could see where it's cute, but I'm not buying this. At $2, I'm not buying this. That one is $420. I am done. I am, this is $420. Come on, I have heard it all. Who is paying this? That is insane to me. Wow, my mind has been blown. Okay, so these are moisturizers. All right, let's see. Mmm, this is kind of hard. They're both kind of nice, to be honest. This one almost smells like it has a little sunscreen in it, where this one doesn't really have any kind of smell. So this one, it's just a little bit more luxurious on the skin, kind of blends into the skin easier, where this one almost like sits on top of my hand. I'm gonna go with this one being the expensive one. 
damn it. <laughs> That's some bullshit. $225. What wow. Do you think makes a good moisturizer. Well shit, now I don't know. <laughs> I mean, you want something that's really going to make your skin dewy and glowy, which to be honest, both of my hands are right now. So, in that regard, I'd say maybe price doesn't matter. My go-to moisturizer, and I'm biased, but it is the Daily Water Cream by Uncommon Beauty. It just gives you that beautiful dewy glow. I can load that product on without it clogging my pores. Clearly we have chapstick next. I like a big one. I don't smell anything, but it's very nice. Goes on the lips smoothly. It's nice and hydrating. Okay, this one. My hands are all moisturized from the... I can't open this, you guys. There's a light, a light scent to it, but I can't really make out what it is. But there's a crack in it, so it's gotta be. If you're paying a lot for your packaging, you have to increase your price. So in that regard, I would say packaging is important. I don't think either one of these are that expensive though, to be honest. I would say this one's maybe more expensive only because it's bigger. I love a really big chapstick. I mean, that was the first thing I said about these. Our chapstick feels like a glue stick. Like you're, you know, it's the size of a glue stick. I just feel like you get more for your buck and it's just, I don't know, it's just nice. I love it. Well, this is fancy as shit, so I feel like... But maybe you guys are trying to trick me. Let's be honest, it does not matter when it comes to a wine glass, because they're probably gonna break anyways. <laughs> I've broken so many in my day. And it's not even from being drunk, it's like in the sink, washing it, or it's just dumb. A more expensive wine glass is actually thinner glass, so they break easier. This one is lighter. It's, I think, a tiny bit less thick than the other one. And it's just, it looks cool. I don't know. I'm pouring, pouring wine. <laughs> just to get a feel for the glass, how it holds the wine. This one might be annoying. It's like chasing it. Oh no, it stays. It's kind of nice. I think I would get annoyed of this after a while. I'm still going this one. I knew it. You guys tried to trick me. 125 for two. Not worth it, in my opinion. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> When we were drinking on the show, because we were under 21, we had to put our booze in a red solo cup on Laguna Beach. But that wasn't like a normal thing for me. <laughs> we have sunscreen. They both look to be pretty similar. Maybe this one is slightly more expensive because of the silver part. It's nice. It actually just feels like a moisturizer, which I kind of love. Smells like sunscreen. Looks and feels like a moisturizer, which is nice. This one, um, you're gonna have a good time rubbing that guy in. It's gonna stick around for a while. Which actually makes me feel like there's zinc oxide in it, which makes me think maybe it's more expensive. This one's kinda hard. Good luck at the pool with that. Uh, I'm still gonna go this one being more expensive because look at the difference. <laughs> this is insane. <laughs> Six out of eight. I knew I had expensive taste. <laughs> Thanks for hanging out, you guys. This was a lot of fun. Make sure to check out Uncommon Beauty and Uncommon James at uncommonjames.com. Maybe I should be charging more for my candles if that little one was $125, just saying. What the f <laughs> <laughs>